Time for Halloween weekend. We want to introduce you to the Muck Monster. Okay. It's a Loch Ness-like creature said to reside in the Lake Worth Lagoon. I'm interested. Our Madeline Montgomery is live from downtown West Palm Beach. What should people be looking out for, Maddie? The report goes that if you're looking out over the lagoon, you need to look for ripples or mysterious bubbles, and then you just might see what's said to be a 10-foot creature that lives right here in Palm Beach County. Under the surface of the Lake Worth Lagoon that stretches through miles of Palm Beach County, there's said to be a monster that scientists can't quite catch or identify. We saw this most curious ripple in the waves. It was inexplicable. The name is the Muck Monster of Lake Worth Lagoon. Harvey Rosenfeld is as close to an expert on the creature as there is. He spent years dressing as the Muck Monster for public appearances throughout the state. Over my years as the Muck Monster character, I attended close to 200 public events and the response was amazing. While Harvey's Muck Monster mascot is locally famous, the creature of the Lake Worth Lagoon rose to fame nationwide more than a decade ago after being mentioned on David Letterman and on the History Channel. Here we are in a large metropolitan community. The lagoon is surrounded by people and seawalls and how was it? It was just so surprising that there, that this possibility that there was some unknown creature living in our waters. But is it all just a bunch of Halloween hype? We asked Benji Stute from Palm Beach County's Department of Environmental Resources. You just never know what you're going to find here in Lake Worth Lagoon. The lagoon stretches 21 miles from Palm Beach Gardens down to Boynton Beach, almost exactly the same size as Loch Ness in Scotland. That leaves a lot of places for a monster to hide, but photojournalist Olivia and I decided to see if we could spot the monster for ourselves. Yeah, there you go. The legendary beast evaded us, but we did see many of the other creatures that call the lagoon home. And this incredible diversity of fish and seahorses and octopus and, and spotted eagle rays and all of these different characters. And while the only monster you're likely to see is Harvey, the muck that comes from litter and chemicals and other bad stuff is a real life danger to wildlife in and around the lagoon. Because muck is, is something that the, that the lagoon deals with. Um, and so what that comes from is this nutrient and sediment inputs that come into the lagoon. It was very gratifying to know that I could make, in my small way, make a positive contribution drawing awareness. If you want to learn more about the lagoon or if you want to see for yourself if the muck monster is out there, there's actually going to be a lagoon fest right here in downtown West Palm Beach in a week on Saturday, November 6th. Reporting live in West Palm Beach, Madeline Montgomery, CBS 12 News. Well, I know what I'm going for Halloween next year, right?